It, it takes guts to be an organ donor. government buildings I can't make out too much what's at the door but I see a bunch of arrows pointing the other way Can I help you? Oh no, I definitely don't need your help, brother. Honey, you don't seem like your normal self. See you all's closed. You need us to please leave. It's closed. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Isn't this a Tuesday? Where are they on vacation? Yeah. The city hall is closed. Can you guys please leave? Why is it closed, man? Why it's closed because it? of COVID still. We it's don't have it. open. Walk right in. Should have been locked. I'm sorry. But can you guys please leave? Is the police department closed? Nope. Their doors are down the hallway. Can we just... Nope. Yeah. You have to go outside and go around. That seem a little bit ridiculous. I mean, he just told you he's closed because of COVID. So that means nobody's allowed in here. Why then would he let you walk through the whole daggone facility? Right here. No. Nope, because the hall's closed. It looks so open to me, man. I didn't even see any signs out here. Yeah, it's, That's it's, posted. Posted. it's posted on the it's door. It's 8 a.m. to 4 yep. p.m. Monday through Friday. Doesn't say anything about closed. It's on the signs out in the door. If you want to check outside and look at the doors, it says it's closed due to COVID. All right, man. Well, I didn't see that to be honest, but if it's open, if the door is open and the business hours are eight to four, it's open, man. I will that. that is probably one of the dumbest things I've ever heard one of these people say. Just because the door is open. We'll All right. The Sounds good. Get that figured out then for sure, yeah. brother. Please leave. Clearly was just told. It's closed. Clearly was just told you couldn't walk down the hallway to the police station. Clearly just tries to walk past him. What are you doing, man? You stepping in front of him? Yep, city hall's closed. Please leave. Boom. Roast it. It's open. No, it's not. It's closed. It's closed because of COVID still. Dude, COVID's open. I don't, you know, we're not doing this whole thing. COVID. Dude, everyone's here at work. I did not mute that. Clearly they did. Makes you wonder what they were saying, huh? Hours are posted on the windows. It's open. The door's open. Well, we'll find out why the doors were unlocked, so. All right, well, that's for you guys to figure out. It's not yes. really my thing, dude. Please leave. He's about to start talking to him twisted. Like he's trying to start a fight with him. And I don't get it. Everybody wants to run around and play Billy Bad Butt nowadays. Let me tell you something. The real tough guys are fighting in cages. I don't know what this starting nonsense with people older than you are, but it's nonsense. Dude, you're trying to look. I'm just going to tell you like I tell everybody, man. I'm here to investigate. I'm here to educate. If you try to lit violate, I'm going to have to litigate. You understand? Know? Thing. I've asked you to leave City Hall twice. You're refusing to leave City Hall. Look, so you're, now, you're law enforcement, not feelings enforcement. You're not orders enforcement either. Yes, I am orders enforcement. I'm asking you to So whatever leave. you say is the law? I'm asking you to please leave. Okay, and I'm telling you, enforce hey, the law, bro. Can you call back to police department, please? You're the chief? Please leave, yes. Dude, this is ridiculous. I'm asking you to please leave City Hall. Okay, dude, you're law enforcement. What law is that? We are closed. Please leave. Bro, it's open. No, it's not. We're, we're closed. We're able to walk right in. Yes, and I'll figure out why that happened. 
Can you we'll guys figure out why it happened, but it's not our problem that it happened, man. I'm asking you guys to People, we've been around here for the past two days and seen people walk right in. No, you haven't. Yes, I have. Only city workers are, are inside here. So what are you guys doing here, then? It It's called a job. You know, people get up early, go to work, you know, do laboring things to feed their family. I mean, I don't expect you to understand, but I mean, it's something that most of the world does, you know, because we care about our loved ones. So the public, or you just sit here and talk to each other and you guys flirting or something? No. No? Do you have a job to do? Yes, I'm doing my job. I'm asking you to Is your leave. job to stand there in the doorway and talk to her? We are talking about city officials, business. Right, okay, man. But again, dude, it's not my problem that the thing is, is unlocked, that the, we'll the hours out. are posted all on the door. Please leave. Please stop giving unlawful orders. It's not an unlawful order. I'm asking you to please leave the city hall because... In order for an order for me to be lawful, it's got to have a law behind it, man. City is... We have an ordinance right now saying that city hall is closed. Could you show me that ordinance? If you step outside, I'll get get take care of it. No, you know what? As a matter of fact, let's go over to the police department, man. You walk outside, you walk down. Is there something over there that I should no. That I should know about? City hall is closed. How many times does one person have to be told? No. 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 So you're just going to be ridiculous and ask that I walk out in the cold when there's a hallway leading right to the police department. Yes. Boom. Roast it. That is silly. What's up with you, man? You got a problem? Nope. Okay. Okay, so how do people pay their utilities, brother? By phone. By phone? By phone, or they have a drop box. Okay. Well, why are the hours posted right behind the door? You're a city worker. Please leave. Why? Because I'm asking you to. Okay, man. Okay, here's the thing. Hey, here's the thing. Right now, you I've asked you. So you're going gonna, you're gonna to try to get aggressive? No. Okay. I've asked you three times. We've seen this before. Or mm -hmm. numerous times to ask you to please leave. Right, but I don't you're, have to you're, follow your orders. I just got to follow the law. What you just said is one of the most insanely idiotic things I have ever heard. That is the law. I'm asking you to leave. <clears throat> you're in violation of the city ordinance. Please leave. What city ordinance? It's we right have, here. You got the city ordinance? Can I'm I see it? I'm not giving it to you. Boom. Roast it. If, if I, I it's right here, I'll read it to you. Well, if I can't see it, man, I can't. Well, then I can't help it. He just you got it right there. I'm the mayor. <clears throat> okay, man. It's time to leave. You always like the chief. Yes, I do. Yeah. Yes, I do, especially for people like you, so it's time. What? Boom. Roast it. What <laughs> people like me? What do you mean it's time to <laughs> okay. leave? People like I'm going to tell you this one you. more time. What are you going to do if we don't? What's going to happen? I'll tell you what he meant by people like you. Morons. Those with cameras that go around shoving it in other people's faces for the sake of their own gain. Because you don't want to get up and actually work a job. I don't know what got any of you out here. Okay, I don't know either one of you. But I know you showed up and decided to bother some innocent people. And that makes you worthless in my book. You can go to jail. Right here. We're going to go to jail. Yeah, you yeah, can. You're in contempt. Yeah, you're in contempt. It's right here, buddy. Contempt and disorder. Can I see it? No. Boom. Roast it. So I'm reading it to you. Well, I don't want you to read it. Well, then I don't. You don't believe me. I don't believe you. Look, how am I going to know that I'm in violation of an ordinance? You can't be in violation if you don't know it's no. Ordinance. Not, you're not touching. I'll give it back to you, no. man. I don't want your fingers on. What's what wrong, dude? Are you racist or something? No. Nope. Pretty sure I'm looking at a white guy talking to a white guy. If I'm wrong, and I'm wrong. I'm part Mexican, and most people don't know it. Being said, it's still a stupid statement. Read you're it. not. You're not no. discriminating. No, sir. Okay. Okay. Let's see, no person shall use violent or contemptuous language, behave in a disorderly manner, or refuse to obey orders of the mayor or presiding officer in the council room. Yes. This isn't the council room, this brother. City Hall. City Hall. Bro, no, this is the council room. Not your brother. It's <laughs>
for a like, public records request. Yeah. Man, keep asking, brother. There's no law. Why yes. are you in here? What do you want? Because I'm here investigating. The fact that... Investigating what? Back up. Dude. Back you're up. trying to intimidate me, man. It doesn't really work on me, dude. You need to leave, too. Dude, there's no law that we're in violation of. Yes. See, hall is closed. Read the signs out there. I just read the ordinance. Signs out there says City Hall is closed. Please leave. I just read the ordinance, man. Please leave. If you want to lock people up for not breaking laws, you are breaking a law. Longer. Nope, there's no law that I'm in violation of, man. Yeah. Yeah, City Hall is closed. I just read the law to you. It says if you are disobeying a mayor's order in the council room, that's a different thing. This sign right here says the City Hall is closed. We were closed due to COVID. And we're still closed due to COVID. Yes, so please leave. So no one in here has ever had COVID. That's the reason, because we did COVID. But where's the law that says that, man? You can't just put up signs everywhere. Yes, we have the right. I have the right to put that sign up in the city of Clinton. But where does the law say that? Look at any state statute. I have. Good. Okay. No, I do this for a living. <laughs> <laughs> word. He just told them to put, they have to wear masks. That's good. No, you can't just have a mask mandate for the public, man. That's a policy for the employees. Well, you need to talk to the mayor of Pennsylvania, but right now you need to exit. That's fine, City man. Hall. This is Indiana. This is Indiana. Need to exit. Dude, I'm telling you, you can tell me, please leave, please leave, but it's not a law. I don't know. Yeah, obey. it's disorderly conduct now. No, it's not, man. Yes, it's a have violation. Have you ever read the statute for disorderly conduct? It's fighting or tumultuous behavior. It's also not listening to the commands no, of the law. No, it's not, man. You haven't read it, and I just I just advised you of it. So if you go hands on, you've lost your qualified immunity. Okay. I've just advised you that that's not a law, man. You guys can do yourself a favor and just go back to doing your job. This is not looking good on you guys. Oh, not looking shit. good on you. Either. Not looking good on you, brother. Okay, brother. Uh, you're just an American Wait. like I am. No, I want you in this country, buddy. Now this is the whole reason why I agreed to do the video. This was sent to me by a subscriber. I skipped through the video, and I almost wasn't even going to do a video on it, to be honest with you. But then this this statement right here happened. I'm going to play what he's going to say, and I'm going to say something on the other side of it. Because I find what he says to be one of the dumbest things spoken in the English language. This guy wants to say that he fought for this country, so we better respect him. Well, hate to break it to him, but just because he fought for the politicians that are ruining our country doesn't mean he's fighting for our country. Yeah, I'm our men and women do not enlist because of politicians. Our men and women do not go out to fight for our politicians. Our men and women go out to fight for the future of their family and their nation. To keep evil at bay instead of coming home. Those who join our armed forces do so to defend America and our way of life. I don't agree with politicians on either side. But one thing's for certain. We don't go pointing the finger at those who make things happen. These younger ones, do you not understand that you owe your very way of life to veterans i mean do they not get it fighting for this country too against yeah, people like you like against like dude do not touch my stuff dude. i can if i want to hey. no. <laughs> my stuff leave that's called vandalism no it's not yeah it is it's blocking so now you're getting a vandalization charge oh please do yeah you are brother you are please leave. absolutely Dude, stop getting close to me, man. One, you're harassing, you're yeah. intimidating. No, you're harassing. You're no. harassing us. We're here in a public the building. Life of Sand Hill. You go back to doing your job. All no, you guys go back to doing job. your job. I, I, this is my job. Are you, you trying do. to push my thing? You're no. harassing us. We're here in a public the building. The of Sand Hill. You go back to doing your job. All no, you guys go back to doing job. your job. Hey, good night. Y'all got some nerve to go mess with somebody who's on the clock. You guys don't even have a clock to check in with. And then this whole auditing thing. Do, do you think this is going to last forever? You're stupid. This isn't going to last forever. You guys are already blowing it up now. Eventually, it's going to come to an end. I got it. Yeah. Hey. I got it. Man, are you a kid? Didn't your mommy tell you to not touch?
out. Get this on camera, bro. Oh, I got it too. Out the doors. Yep. Come on. Out the doors with your big beer belly. <laughs> you look pathetic, man. If you want to take that badge off, we can figure out who's a tough guy. Sometimes I'll start a sentence, and I don't even know where it's going. I just hope I find it along the way. Nope. You don't want to. That's nice. That's right there. No, you're. Come on, take the badge off and let's go somewhere else. Let's go to private property and you can fight. You want to? I'm giving you the chance to consent. Are you just. Oh, you're assaulting me. Pig, I swear to God, bro, this is why cops drop. You hear me? We'll keep dropping too. Pigs like you. I'm getting that recording there. I'm going to. It's called public records requests. You think you're so tough. Mm. And hey, man. Hey, brother. I'm giving you a chance, man. If you want to redeem yourself, we can fight, McLaren. I'm giving you a chance. We can fight? How old are you? That man wants to provide for his family. Take care of the community. And go home tonight. Nobody's interested in fighting you losers. Grow up.